An Orange County teacher is on leave tonight, accused of creating inappropriate political videos featuring students. West News' Haley Crumble Home joins us live right now after speaking with parents about what happened. So, Haley, what exactly are they saying about all this? So parents are saying they don't have a lot of information here. They say they did get a robocall telling them that a teacher was placed on leave, but not saying why. When we reached out to the school district, they said Orange County Public Schools will not tolerate our children being used as political pawns, with the superintendent calling the videos inappropriate. Joanne has a daughter at Howard Middle School. She's in sixth grade. And all she knew about a teacher being placed on leave came from a school robocall. It just said that um, an ad, a staff is placed on admin leave. I have no idea what happened. They said they weren't going to give any status of what happened. So and I'm, I doubt the school would tell me either what happened. In that call, the principal says, Well, I cannot discuss employee matters. I can assure you that I will take immediate action anytime a staff member does not act in the best interest of students. Joanne said it's concerning getting a call like that and not knowing why the teacher was placed on leave. Of course, of course, not the first time the school call was something happening before and they just won't tell you. We reached out to the Orange County School District to find out why the teacher was on leave. They sent this statement saying Orange County Public Schools will not tolerate the use of our children as political pawns by anyone, including a classroom teacher. Any employee who creates videos or other content with students in an effort to exploit them for political purposes will be immediately removed from the classroom, placed on administrative leave, and swift action will be taken to terminate employment. With the superintendent quoted as saying, this is not free speech, it is the exploitation of our students for political purposes, and it will not be tolerated in our school district. Now, in that robocall that parents received, it did say that this employee has been turned over to the district's Office of Professional Standards. Live in Orange County, Haley Crumble Home, West 2 News.